electrical access. Sounds promising. on Scorpion. These guys have no idea who they're letting out. You're still out there? Still here! Promise! Oh, come on, back up power. Be here. Sweet! <laughs> Water's rising. I can't get back the way I came in. The electrical current is powerful in here. Even I can feel it. I can't let it get to that guard. This amount of electricity will fry him alive. I need you to stay away from the water, okay? Something. Oh, 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 oh,
Miller. Run! I'm stopping! I'm here, guys! I got you! Lay off me! So I can stop that propeller! I can't whip that propeller with these guys beating on me! We've got him! How many times I gotta tell you people? Lee stays with me! Target sighted! Used to hear that voice, Hold on. Ready, Something tells me that's not a legit business transaction. Deal's off. Why try and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? Huh? Ah! Mike! Mike! He's still breathing, but I'll get him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. <laughs> we, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved him. So, we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh, man. I'm sorry. There. Staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look.
Almost blew up Spider-Man. Wish you were here, Lex. Are they illegal in Jersey, too? What about international waters? Hey, just dropped Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. Bro, watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. Better warn about a shoot in the bed. <laughs> Look at me now, huh? Some guns and fireworks. I don't get you. You look tired. Too scared to fight? I'll find him and put him down. Put him down. We gotta stop him before he gets there. What's wrong over there? This is for the best. Where are you? Birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh man. I hope Mike saw that in the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big.
Danica, you are listening to the Danacast. Get this. Now the fastest growing podcast in New York. Hold on to your knickers, Jonah. I'm coming from the ground. For you new listeners, welcome. The Danacast is your spot for real takes and real news about real people. Did y'all hear about this train worker, Dennis, who single-handedly kept the trains running during the Sandman attack? The main track control booth got cut off by a power failure, and he had to patch in from his cell phone on a hot spot to keep the lines up. Thousands of people got evacuated to Queens and Brooklyn thanks to him. Dennis, we at Denicat salute you. Keep doing what you're doing. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on? How school? College? Anyone you like? I don't know. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. Another gate. I can't pull it open from down here. Yo. You would have made a decent problem. You should be seeing how to get inside. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. are in the mask. Thanks, Dan. Don't be a stranger. I wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer, hijo. Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, Estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. It can't be understood by the conscious mind. But you still get that word spider, bros. Well, well, well. Spider-Man's a shutter bug. Click, click. Yeah. Quick. Yeah, some things in New York you just can't explain. And that's what's great. Miles, up there, remember? You on your way? Oh, right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I... Hold up! 
I'll hit you back. Flame sees you, Spider-Man. <laughs> Sorry, nobody's getting branded today. Beautiful. Out of your mind, Spider-Man. Watch out. <laughs> What was the deal with those guys? Felt like they came out of a coast. Better tell Pete about them. Okay, Genki, I'm all clear. Let's talk. Up there, remember? You on your way? Right. That's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. Pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Nice. Sometimes I worry with all the terrible things that happen in our city. People will be afraid to leave their homes, live their lives. Not today. disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what should have been a routine prison transfer, the Spider-Men felt the need to inject themselves into a city. NYC, the mecca of basketball. Sure, you can play it anywhere with just a ball in the net. But when you got the people in the apartment buildings watching. Okay, you all are done. There's no stopping the prophecy. shouldn't tell Ma about how close I got to an almost exploding gas truck. Hey, Pete, you ready to come by the Foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. <laughs> I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon.
How you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of... Gotta do a thing! One sec! Get Spider-Man! Bad guys oh. harassing those people. Gotta move! Dark! Oh. Better hope I don't get Come out on. of this! You had to know I'd be here sooner or later. Wait, he's always fighting! I'll get you! Next up, book. Sorry, MJ. You know how it is. Anyway, Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Looks like one of Marco's memory crystals Miles told me about. I should check it out. So many puns and I don't even know where to start! Any chance we make this easy? for it later. Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. They're tracking us. Marco made a lot of enemies. Wonder if they finally caught up to him. Hey! Are you crashing my fight or am I crashing yours? <laughs> crashing crime, dude! <laughs> The next post fight piece is on me. <laughs> Whoa. I was wondering what this place was. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. This Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... She got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. 
you know what entomology is. Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. A carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee wolves. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting bees, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves and hold on to them. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to Entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. So much to see here. Where do I even start? Welcome to entomology. Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones, using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. A 
Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Welcome Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Let's start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. You really have a part? Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. So calming, and that we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm-hmm. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. I 
Go ahead. Swipe. Hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on any... Ah! And the Sandcastle competition starts now! And no cheating! Ah! 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 You just had to make it hard, huh? Crack a crystal. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. So I to take matters into my own hands. Marco was really laying low these past few years. I would have helped him if I'd known he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. As he said, he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. Hey, Miles, I'm back. Where were we? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Fire department's on its way, oh, FYI! It's a plane! Everything burns! I'm not staying in this! Throwing a Fires before they could hurt anyone inside. But that was close. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. <laughs> 